everybody, my name is Lindsay and I work at the Canmore Public Library and this is Miss Lindsay's Corner. Today we're in my kitchen because we're going to be doing something extra special. We're going to be baking something today. I have a very special helper with me in the kitchen today. This is my daughter Piper. She's four years old. Say hi Piper. Hello. Now we're making one of our favorite things to make, but before I tell you what it is, I want you to see if you can guess. I will share three of the ingredients we'll be using, and you see if you can guess what we're going to make. We're going to need brown sugar in our recipe today. We're going to need one egg in our recipe today. And Piper's favorite ingredient, we're going to need chocolate chips. Chocolate chips. So, what do you think we could be making that needs brown sugar, an egg, and chocolate chips? Why don't you tell them what it is? Yeah. Chocolate chip cookies! Chocolate chip cookies! Yay! Our favorite. My recipe that I use for chocolate chip cookies, I got from Sally's BakingAddiction.com, and I'll link it down below. So, before we get started, I need to let you know that you must ask your mom or dad for help in the kitchen if you want to bake or cook. Piper and I are wearing our aprons to protect our clothes. We've already washed our hands so that they're nice and clean. And we have the oven preheated to 350 degrees. And we're ready to get started. So the first thing we're going to do is cream together the butter and sugar. We have three quarter cups of butter that will go into the bowl. We have three quarter cups of brown sugar. Yes, Piper, can you please dump that in the bowl? All of it in there. Perfect. Thank you. It does. And then we have one quarter cup of white sugar. Thank you. You're welcome. All of it. All of it, yeah. There we go. So we have in our bowl. Mix it. Yeah, we're going to let the machine do the mixing for us today. Thank you. So, in our bowl, we have our butters and our sugars. And we're going to mix them until they're all nice and smooth together. When Bob was in there, it looked like a heart. Mm -hmm. This might get a little loud. does love eggs. And then we have two teaspoons of vanilla. Can you pour that in for me, please? Mm, it, smells like it. it does smell very yummy. I just want to eat some vanilla. <laughs> and then we're going to mix that together one more time now that we have our egg and our vanilla added. Two cups of flour. You want to help me pour that in? All of it. All of it in. And then in here, I have one teaspoon of baking soda, a half a teaspoon of salt, and the secret ingredient that makes these chocolate chip cookies stay nice and soft and chewy. We have two teaspoons of cornstarch. You want to dump that in? Yeah. Thank you, Piper. Excellent. Now, I like to give my dry ingredients a quick stir on top. And can I stir it? Go ahead. 
<laughs> Gently, or flies everywhere. All right, thank you, Piper. Now we're going to let the mixer do its job and mix those all together. Now you can mix these with a wooden spoon. You don't need a mixer. But I do a lot of baking, so that's why we have one. Yeah, me too. Mm -hmm. And once those are all combined, we get to add the best ingredient of all. We get to add the chocolate chips. Can I do? Can I put it in? Would you like one? Mommy, um, you just want me and I eat. Mm -hmm. All right. Now we're going to dump in the chocolate chip. The chocolate chip. Oh, I'm, oh, I'm sorry. I just couldn't take the bowl off. Why? Well, that's fine. Is this ingredient? Yeah, thank you. All right, and that's all there is to it. These cookies are very simple and very delicious. We want to make sure we get all the cookie dough off the spatula. All right, and there's our cookie dough all ready to go. Doesn't it look yummy? Okay, so I have an extra large cookie sheet <laughs> that we are going to scoop all of our cookies on. It is. We can fit all the cookie dough on one hand. Me can both take turns. Sure. Can I do them first? So I have a cookie scoop. If you don't have a cookie scoop, you can just drop these by a tablespoon onto your pan. Mm -hmm. There, excellent. Looks so, those look so yummy. So great. Mm -hmm. I only did one. You go. Alright, while we wait for our cookies to bake, I'm going to read you a story about cookie dough. Who ate all the cookie dough? By Karen Beaumont. Who ate all the cookie dough? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Who ate all the cookie dough? Who do you think it might be? Kanga looks around to see. Lion, lion, do you know? 
Who ate all the cookie dough? I don't know. It wasn't me. Maybe Zebra. Let's go see. Zebra, Zebra, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? I don't know. It wasn't me. Maybe Llama. Let's go see. Llama, Llama, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? I don't know. It wasn't me. Maybe Cheetah. Let's go see. Cheetah, Cheetah, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? I don't know. It wasn't me. Maybe Hippo. Let's go see. Hippo, Hippo, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? I don't know. It wasn't me. Maybe Monkey. Let's go see. Monkey, monkey, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? Where is monkey? Where'd he go? Did he eat all the cookie dough? Yes, no, maybe so. Monkey see, monkey do, it wasn't me, tee hee. Then who? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Who? all the cookie dough. Doesn't anybody know? We know, we know, we know who. See if you can guess it too. They're all pointing fingers at the kangaroo. Did she? It was baby kangaroo. Boom. The end. Hello everyone, I'm Becky. And my mother, she works at the library and we're going to sing Who Ate the Cookie Jar? Who ate the cookies from the cookie jar? Piper ate the cookies from the cookie jar. Me? Yes, you. Oh, then who? Mommy ate the cookies from the cookie jar. Yeah. Who me? Yes, you. Could be. Then who? Grandma ate the cookies from the cookie jar. Who, me? Yes, you. Couldn't be. It's who? Max. Max. <laughs> the moment we've all been waiting for. Our cookies are done and ready to eat. Thanks for joining me, everybody. I'll see you next time at Miss Lindsay's Corner. I'm Tamar Tupac. I love you. <laughs> Bye.